What is up guys? So here we have the first of many fishing videos I want to put out for this game and this is the it was this big trophy achievement. Now the location I'm showing you here which is just southeast of the flat neck station on the pier is how you initiate the legendary quests and the, the trophy guy that I'm showing you now has nothing to do with the legendary quest but I thought just showing you this quickly is going to help with your fishing progress anyway. So head down to this guy, initiate your quest, he will give you the map of all the locations of the legendary fish, and then I want to show you where to get the lures to actually do that. So speak to this gentleman at the end of the pier, and you're good to go. Hello, chum. Chum? There's no money in tiddlers. So I hear. Alright, so after that, he's going to give you the legendary map. Or fish map, should I say. And then from here, we're going to take you all the way across to the east side of the map to grab the lures and grab the trophy as well. So, as you can see here, they're not actually labeled, and to find the locations is still going to be quite difficult. Everything about this game is absolutely amazing, including the weather. I just stood here for a while watching it. It's absolutely insane. But once you've soaked all that in, we're going to head, like I said, to the east side of the map to a place called La Grasse and there is a bait shop here. And like I said before, the fish we're going to catch, you don't actually need to buy the special lures. Just the normal medium lures will work because the fish are just generally massive. The sturgeons. So there we go. Off we head in that direction. Once we get there, the weather has changed and the swamp area is also insane. I mean, every single tree is different. It's that's mind-blowing. But anyway, we're going to head up to the chick over here, and she's going to sell you the special lures because you've spoken to that stranger. Lake, swamp, and river. There we go. Now you set for your legendary fish catching. And as you can see, I've combined two, two footages here because this is the sunny footage, and then just behind me over there, there is a pier. And that's where I went and decided to hit fish for the sturgeon, which is this location. So I used the swamp lure, obviously. And I do skip this ahead because I completely incorrectly try and catch this fish. Now what I'm going to do is show you a little cutaway of how you actually meant to reel it in. It's very easy, very monotonous, very straightforward. So what you want to do is cast your cast and then wait for a hook. And if you tap R2, every 10 seconds or so it does also help because it jerks the line just like that but don't do it too much but once he's on the line this simple simple strategy you want to follow and that is just after he's uh, after he's fighting pull the rod down pull the rod up pull the rod down pull the rod up and it greatly increases the rate at which you reel in as you can see how far away this fish was he didn't even get a second chance to struggle so it makes fishing incredibly quick now i didn't know this when i was trying to catch that sturgeon which i'm going to jump back to right now which is why I'm probably going to skip quite a bit of it, because I think I battled about 15 minutes with him, not realizing that uh, he wasn't actually getting closer to the shore, to the shore at least. So with this kind of fish, it's massive, and I thought it was just big because uh, that's how long it was taking me to get in, but it was just the incorrect strategy that I was using. So let's skip ahead again till he's a bit closer. As you can see now, I pull the rod up accidentally, but in the fashion that you want to really, and the fish is right there. You, sir, are a fish. Whoa, what are you? A sturgeon, perhaps. A very large sturgeon. Yes. And there is the trophy. All right, guys, I'm going to leave you with some end screens as per usual. And uh, keep in mind, there's tons of videos coming out. I'm busy in the middle of the legendary fish locations, as well as the strategies to catch them. So keep track of that. And uh, hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. It really helps the channel. So I want to say thank you so much for watching, guys. And I'm going to catch you on the next one.